Um, we know that aspirin can have interesting effects on the body in regards to cancer. Um, we also know that cancers, when they metastasize or when tumor cells spread throughout the body, they often hide themselves in a, in a shield of platelets. Um, they surround themselves with platelets. One of the things that aspirin does is it reduces um, certain genes involved with platelet production. And so it can reduce the platelets. And so um, we've known for years that daily aspirin can slow cancers down, but the data is really accumulating daily now. In fact, a study, a recent study just came out and it showed in colorectal cancer with PIK, AKT driven tumors, there was almost a 50% reduction in recurrence in colorectal cancers with these with um, PIK 3CA mutations just from daily aspirin. So that kind of empowerment, reducing your recurrence rate by 47%, you know, over a, sp a specific period of time with a daily aspirin, that's gold. You know, that sort of information is gold. And so once again, it gets back to self-empowerment and, and educating yourself on all of the various mechanisms. Understanding the mechanisms is the most important aspect, whether it's psychology, you know, whether it's going to the moon, you know, whether it's medicine. It has to be mechanism-based, not statistical-based.